Hello everyone, I'm Tim from Tim's PC and in this video we're going to talk about Revatuna Statistics Server also known as the Revatuna Overlay. So let me share my screen with you and we'll have a chat about what this tool is and why you might want to set it up. So here we've got the Heaven Benchmark so I'm just going to go ahead and run that one. Alrighty, so we can see this overlay of statistics that's on the screen here. So it's telling me all this all this important information like our graphics card temperature, utilization, speeds, wattages, same for our CPU and our RAM. And it's even displaying the, the current frames per second that it's running at, running this benchmark. So if you want to set this up on your own computer, you can do it with MSI Afterburner. Revatuna Statistics Server is an app that is included with MSI Afterburner. It is an optional extra that you can install, but it is selected as something that will install automatically. So if you didn't turn it off, it will be installed with MSI Afterburner. So to set it up, we need to go into settings of MSI Afterburner. And first up, we need to go to our on sorry to our monitoring page, and we need to select in this list the statistics that we want to show in the on-screen display. So in monitoring, you will find a list of different statistics that you can show on the screen. So all you need to do is select it, and then just select Show in on-screen display. Really easy. Click Apply. Then next, go to our on-screen display. So we need to set these up with, with different keys to turn things on and off. So I'm actually going to adjust these. And then we need to go to more. And then we bring up Revatuna Statistics Server. So we can turn the show our own statistics on and we can change the size of the display. So if you only want like a really small, um, like little small readout in the corner, you can have that, or you can have it bigger, like how I do when, um, when I do my videos and live streams. And so that's pretty much it. Once you set it up the way that you want it, when you go into a benchmark, for example, we'll just open up the valley quickly here. I can now turn it off by hitting Control F12, and I can turn it on by hitting Control F11. And that's pretty much it. It's really simple to set up, and I think it's a, a good tool to have if you want to monitor the um, the temperatures and and operating conditions of your rig while you're gaming. So thanks everyone for watching. I hope you found this video informative. Be sure to like and subscribe and I'll catch you all in the next